Hello boys and girls, my name is Mrs Curry and along with Mrs McCabe, the head teacher and your class teachers, I'm going to make sure you have a great time when you're here at St Minions, that you do great learning, make fabulous progress and feel happy, safe and have lots of fun. Now, the school is very, very quiet just now. There's no one here because all the children like you are at home staying safe. It's just me here and Mr Curry making the video. I loved coming to meet you in your nurseries. It was so lovely to see you all there. And I feel really sad that you're not going to be able to come to, perhaps not going to be able to come to school before you start primary one. So I thought I could make a wee film of the school to show you exactly what it's going to look like when you come in August. There's nobody here at all. It's very quiet. Let's go and have a look around. When you come to school in the morning, these are the stairs that you'll come down all the way down into the playground where you'll see all the other boys and girls in primary one, two and three will be waiting to go into class. I will always be in this playground every morning to meet you when you come in as well as some of the other teachers and ladies who will be looking after you here at St Ninian's. This is the playground where you'll come to play at interval with all of your friends too. If you're a bus person who gets the bus to school, these are the gates that you'll come in. Mr Murray, our janitor, will be there to meet you coming off of the bus and your bus buddy will make sure that you're taken safely into this playground where I'll be waiting to meet you. This is the primary one classroom door here. I'm going to take you into the corridor, into the corridor now. And this is the cloakroom where you'll hang your coat on your peg and leave your school bag. These are the toilets that you'll use in primary one. And then this is the primary one classroom. You can see it's very bright and colourful. Lots of tables and chairs where you'll sit with your friend. And this is the rainbow room, which is right beside the primary one classrooms. And there's always lots of activities, play activities set up in here for primary one to support their learning. Boys and girls have great fun in here. Now, the corridors are very quiet just now, but normally primary one do a lot of learning out here. We've got lots of space and a lot of learning activities are set up out here. So when you come into primary one, you'll find you're out here a lot of the time or in the rainbow room or in your classroom doing lots of great learning. We're so lucky in this lovely school to have so many big open spaces for the boys and girls to learn. This is the gym hall where you'll come for PE. As you can see, we've got lots of great equipment here at St Ninians. And you'll find out more about what to wear for PE later. Now I'm going to show you the mugga where we come to do PE on ni in nice days and also in rainy days. So you've got to have all your outdoor PE equipment and um, it's a huge big space we come here for PE sometimes we have outdoor assemblies and also we do the mug a mile out here as well where you get to meet all your friends and family from throughout the school the 
The canteen's very quiet just now and all the tables are folded up, but on a usual school day, these tables would be all ar around the room, full of boys and girls enjoying their lunch. You might bring a packed lunch to school and that's absolutely fine, or maybe you might choose to have your lunch in school. There are usually four choices of lunch, a red choice, a blue choice, a yellow choice, and a green choice. And you, before you come to school in the morning, your mum should have a look at the menu, your mum or dad, and help you decide what you want to eat for lunch that day. And then you'll come in in the morning and tell your teacher. And she will give you a band which matches the choice of lunch you're having. When you come to the canteen, you'll choose a tray which matches your band. At the end of the day, you'll leave by the same door. Your teacher will stay with you in the playground till your mum or dad have come to collect you. Now, lots of mums and dads and grands and grandpas like to stand at that gate over there but it actually is really hard for you to see them when there's lots of adults there and also very difficult for you to push your way through. So we encourage all the mums and dads to stand right opposite your classroom door because that's the easiest spot for you to see them. Nearer to the summer holidays, um, your mums and dads and families will receive information about the uniform and about other bits and pieces that they need to know for you coming to school so that you have all the information you need um, information about the menu can be found on the Inverclyde Council website and also our school um, handbook is online as well for parents to have a look at. I really hope you've enjoyed this wee short tour around the school. We're so looking forward to you being part of our family here at St Ninians.